Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. If you've just come into an absolute load of money, what do you do about it? The answer is, you hold a massive Christmas party involving turkey and a cake and more cake and Christmas tree and balloons. Look at them all. Look at them all go. Oh, it's very exciting. Oh, Chris, you're not going to work today, love. Oh, no, no, no. There'll be none of that. No, you will not. You'll be going out and you'll be fraternising and eating. Mostly eating. Oh dear, we're not getting on. And um, we're still in our pyjamas, but that's okay. It doesn't matter because Mortimer has brought us some flowers. Here we go. Loads and loads of food. Merry Christmas, everybody! Yay! Oh, look at it. It's brilliant, Michael. Has anybody spoken to you there? Let's have a joke. You go and talk to Jeff. There we go. Oh, my balloons haven't lasted very long, have they? That's a bit rubbish. Oh, well. Never mind. We're all here now. We've got a punch bowl. Let's get the punch going. Oh, yes. Look at that. And the, the presents under the tree. There are presents under the tree. <gasps> there are presents under the tree. Open the present. Don't stamp on the present. Open the pre Oh. Fine. Chris, do you want to go and get your present as well? Go on. There's another present for you. No, don't put this stuff on the floor. I'm not sure about... What, what's going on here? Why are we all stamping on the presents? Don't stamp on the presents. I paid a lot for that tree. Didn't pay much for the present. Go and open the present. Go on. Oh, dear, oh dear. That's terrible. Oh, oh, we're all bubbling. And we're talking about aliens. It's time for... Turkey! Oh, look at my balloon. My balloons are all gone. Oh, that's rubbish. Balloons are rubbish. Oh, here we all come. You see, it's time for turkey. Applaud. That's it. You applaud. And we're all talking about the turkey. Wow. Carve the turkey. Carve it. Carve it. Oh. Look at that. Wow. That definitely deserves a round of applause. And now we can all have some turkey. Except for Chris. Because she can't get near the turkey because there's somebody standing in the way of it. That's it. You have some punch instead. There we go. Go and get some turkey. Oh, somebody's clearing up for us as well. This is the best Christmas ever! Brilliant. Well, in that case, we'll have some cake as well. Go on. Go and get some cake. No, not more turkey. Cake! Fine. Chris, you can go and get some cake. You'll understand the importance of this. Oh, there we go. Great. We've got turkey. We've got cake. We've got... We won't talk about the presents. We've got punch. We've got food. Look at the food. That's fantastic. We've got... Bills on the floor. Let's just ignore the bills. Go and clean up the newspapers, though, because that's really quite unpleasant not going to look very good, is it? Right, Melissa, do you want to do some cleaning up? There we go. Stop watching horror films. Start doing some cleaning up. The turkey's gone off already. What? Defective balloons? Pathetic turkey? What? What is going on here? Going into the, going into the bin. Oh, well, at least we've still got... Oh, we haven't. Right, okay, we'll go and clean the table then. That's okay. You just go and clean up. This didn't last very long, did it? Punch is still going, though. Still got punch. Yeah. Female entertainer or a male entertainer? Having a male entertainer coming out of cake, possibly a little strange, maybe. Just doesn't feel quite right somehow. Go on. Go on. Off you go. Before everybody goes home because they can't get in the toilet. Here we go. Adults only. Oh dear, oh. Huh. Yeah, I'd, I'd be telling people to get away as well. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh. 
Yeah, I, I'd be booing that as well. Oh, God almighty. I Don't look. It's tasteless. Um, yeah. That didn't end so well, did it? You are rubbish. Go away. Oh, it's that oh dear. Um tell you what, you 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 sneak off to bed. You sneak off to bed. Uh, Chris, how are you doing? Oh not not so good. You you go and have a shower. Don't worry about entertaining people anymore. This has all gone very, very wrong. I thought I told you to go away. Yeah, that's probably not a bad idea. I've come to collect my child since it's way past bedtime and you appear to have had an adult entertainer in the house. And alcohol. And everything's got flies all over it. Just get just get rid of her, would you? Just get rid of her. It's, it's just been embarrassing. Just just go. You're very, very bad. Just go. You're very, very bad. Get out of my house. Just go. How many times do I have to tell you? Just leave. Please leave. You're disturbing me now. You won't... Oh, good grief. Just go. You you go to bed, Chris. She won't... She won't... Oh! Oh! Well, that was the best trick of the night. Nobody saw it. Oh! Didn't know she did magic tricks as well. Good heavens, right. Well, that was... um That was exhausting. Um, Not sure that that was actually the best idea. I think that was a bit of a waste of money. Oh no, no, woman, leave! I'm sorry. No, you need to. You need to go. This is. Oh, this is appalling. Just go, please. Maybe if she tells you to go instead, you'll go. Just go. Get out of my house. Yes. Goodbye. Thank you. Talk about outstaying your welcome. Oh no. After all that, we've got cockroaches. Right, Chris, you do need to go to work today, so off you go. And I need to get rid of the memory of this. What do you mean it can't be deleted? Well, in that case, I'm going to put it all the way over here where I don't have to think about it anymore, because that was disturbing. Ooh, that's better. So... Oh, good grief. Have you seen this? Have you... How many flies? I'm breaking some sort of world record for flies. I'm going to have to sort all this out. So, you can go and eat the food that Chris has so kindly prepared and didn't manage to get a chance to eat because she was going to work, which funds all this rubbish. And then I'm afraid, I hate to tell you this, there's a lot of work to do. Oh, there's a lot of work to do. On the plus side, there is still some alcohol. What was this? Stand beneath. Stand beneath. Oh, no! No, no, no! Don't! You can't do that. Oh, what a mess. I'm never, ever, ever having a Christmas party again. This is an absolute disgrace. Right, there must be something more behind there. Because this... Oh, good heavens. There's just flies everywhere. This is awful. If I answer the phone and it's somebody else offering me £1,500... I might say no. Do you know what I did with my last £1,500? Oh dear. Oh well. I'll say it was awful and appalling. The balloons didn't last. People stamped on the presents. The food went off. The toilet needed cleaning. I'd be having a drink as well. And at the end of it, the stripper wouldn't leave. Oh, and somebody... Oh, I don't want to talk about that, but it's going to have to be cleared up. I'm really sorry for this massive... Oh, 
with this massive list of jobs that you've ended up doing. But that's what you get if you want to have a bit of fun. And we've now got a nice tree. Oh god, what if the nice tree just turns into a load of flies? Do I, can I just get rid of the nice tree? Oh, I can. Right, well, we'll, we'll keep it out because it is still Christmas, effectively. And relax. Good. Oh, hang on. More flies. No? Oh, they're there. You having a buffet table in your bedroom also possibly not the best thing. Might, might uh, sell that one on. There we go. Get a bit of money back on the disaster. Yeah, you see, you're bored now, aren't you? You're bored. I don't blame you. You're going off for a drink. I don't blame you for that either. I'd be having a drink. I'd be having several drinks. Good. Now go and read a book and we can all recover. Phew! Well, that was a really bad idea, wasn't it? We've still got flies. I don't know where they're coming from. And that's really, really irritating. Right, we'll sell that off. And we'll, uh, we'll get rid of whatever that was. Oh, mistletoe. Oh, it was mistletoe. Mm. Missed a chance there. got a bit of money. Good! That's good. Thank goodness for that. Because there's bills all over the floor. Sorry. Sorry about that. Folks, there are. Oh. Chris, all you ever do is eat. Don't eat crisps. Eat something worth eating, please. And don't leave your rubbish on the floor. You've lived in this house long enough to know that that is the wrong thing to do. Do you know how long your housemate has, sp has spent clearing up after the utter disaster of a Christmas party. And now we've got to pay all these bills. I don't know why I bother. In fact, I'm so angry about this. Do you know what? I'm, I'm tempted just to sell the Christmas tree because this hasn't been much of a Christmas at all. Even the lights have gone off now. It's always nice to see that they're getting on, at least. Because they do get on, look, they've got a little smiley face. Shame about everybody else. Chris, do you get on with anybody? No, you don't. Oh dear. Please, not more bills. No, good, we've paid them off. Good. Good, I'm glad about that. We can all relax now. Great. Well, that was um, utterly misguided. And I definitely won't be doing that again. But at least I can leave them to it now. They're happy, aren't they? They're happy. Yeah, they are. Good. In that case, we'll do what I intended to do. And we'll move on. We've got the Pleasants. We've got the Bachelors. We've got the Goths. And we've got... Yeah, we don't talk about that house. The Pleasants. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, but the Goths. The Goths. They live in a big house. Let's have a big house. With a big fence outside it. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. People with big fences. It doesn't work for me. Right, so what do we have? We've got an upstairs. Wow. Okay. And we've got some cash. Good. It's time to buy things then. Hurrah. Right, this is a sort of kitchen living room. So, dare I spend loads of money on an oven? Maybe not for the time being. Oven. Then we need a fridge. Dare I spend loads of money on a fridge? Hunger 6, hunger 7. Not very stylish, is it, that one? We'll have the expensive fridge. There we go. Surfaces. Yes! What matches the room? Nothing, really. Could just have the cheap ones, eh? Mm, no, how about that? Oh, that kind of works. Yeah, go on then. When I say kind of. <laughs> and then we can put some extras in here. And 
then, what else will we be needing? A food processor. And we need a sink. There we go. Good. Now, what do we need next? We need a bathroom, because otherwise there's going to be some trouble. So we'll get one of those. Again, doesn't look particularly great, does it? That looks like it's out of an airport. I don't really want a toilet that looks like it's out of an airport. But I could spend loads of money on the toilet to stop them constantly getting locked up. That would be a... Yeah, that would be an answer. There we go. Decent toilet this time around. We could have a green sink. There we go. Good. And now somewhere to sit down. Sofas. Oh no, oh no. This is a classy, classy place. How about that? It doesn't quite match, does it? Not quite. How about the blue one? Think that's any better? How about that? Look, that kind of fits there, doesn't it? I think. Go on then, we'll do that. And then we could fit some kind of something. Posh bookcase this time. There we go. That works. And then we need somewhere for people to sleep. Second story. Ooh. We've got two balconies, but it's all one big room. Is it all one big room? Does everybody sleep together in this house? Hey, that's really creepy. Are you kidding me? The upstairs is only one room. What's wrong with them? Does somebody sleep on the patio? Well, this looks like a kind of living room to me. Well, that's no good. How many people are we talking about? Got a oh it's a uh oh hang on no who belongs who belongs where is it two adults and a child so the child I suppose technically could sleep downstairs that's very weird though unless they put the child out on the balcony oh they might do I'd not thought of that hmm something not working about this house for me let's put some extra walls in hmm. Let's see if I divided that up there, and then we've got the stairs. That doesn't work. This this house doesn't work at all, does it? Not even slightly. That's weird. Okay, I'll make some decisions about where they may or may not sleep in a in a moment. I could divide that up. There could be a bedroom there, and then the adults could have the whole of upstairs. I can't get my head around this. This is just strange. Nope, that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. Right, you lot, you better be happy. It is three of them, isn't it? Yeah. Right, what else do you need? You need a phone. Electronics. Phones. There we go. What else is in electronics? Smoke detector. That's probably not a terrible. Big speakers. Big telly. What's that? Burglar alarm. Burglar alarm? Oh, this is a posh house now. Need to keep people out of it. There we go. What's this? Dance floor. Oh, <gasps> Jukebox. Ooh, I've got plans for the living room, I think. Never mind dividing it off into another bedroom. I've got big plans for the living room. Um, whoop. I don't know what I'm doing that. What am I doing? No, it is in electronics, isn't it? There we go. Oh, spend all the money. Jukebox. <laughs> With a tiny dance floor in front of it. That works for me. Mortimer, go and dance. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're all in on it now. Come on, then. We hold a better party than next door already. Celebrate! Look at me going round and round in circles. 
Yeah, that's brilliant. <laughs> you just had to ruin that, didn't you? You just had to. Good! Okay. Well, it doesn't look like I'm going to wreck these people's lives at all. It looks like they're going to be incredibly happy. Come back in the next episode to find out whether they stay like this. Gameplay Jenny, yeah!